Her name is Josiane Petit, an African-American woman who lives here in Saratoga Springs. Petit works with Black Lives Matter, but also started a group called Mama and Papa Panthers. We caught up with Josiane as she was walking in to conduct a training session with local police here in Saratoga Springs. Petit says she's not certain anything that President Trump says or does at this point will have a major impact on police reform and use of force issues. She is choosing to focus her time and energy on things closer to home. I feel like the president has a credibility issue and therefore whatever he presents will be treated as suspect by both sides. For me, as someone who lives locally, I'm just focused on local government. I wanna know what our legislature is gonna do. I wanna know how they're gonna vote on um, reforming police departments, defunding police departments, et cetera, here in Utah, because that's what I have influence over and that's what impacts me directly. Josiane hopes the president's executive order will have a positive impact but in the meantime, again, she's going to continue to take part in training sessions with local police on what she calls cross-cultural communications.